So what I'm going to do is I'm going to close this finished project and I'm going to open my incomplete project, right? So this is the project that you're going to have if you download it from the link that I showed. And so we're going to start with an empty scene here. Now, the first thing that you need to do is make sure that Vuforia is installed in the player settings. So if you go to edit, project settings, player, and you're going to see down here in the XR settings that in my case, I have Vuforia augmented reality supported turned on, right? If you don't, you'll see a little link saying, hey, click here to download the little installer. It's really quick. And then you just need to restart Unity and you'll be off to the races. So you also want to make sure that you have a webcam connected, right? I'm on a desktop PC and I'm using a wired webcam. And I think even if you're on a laptop, having a webcam for this type of development is really helpful. Using your laptop camera, like trying to turn it around and point it at the image targets is not convenient. So having just a little simple webcam, I'm using a Logic Webcam C270, which works pretty well for me. Um, and so if you're on a laptop that has a built-in webcam, or for some reason you have multiple webcams, you want to make sure that the correct webcam is being used, right? So you're going to do this by going to the resources folder and going to the Vuforia configuration. We were talking about scriptable objects before the stream started. I believe this is just a big scriptable object with all of the settings data for the Vuforia system, right? The key piece here is that our camera device down at the bottom is set to the correct hardware device so that we can uh, so that we can see the world through the eye of our camera. So we wanna have a new scene. I've got one already, but we'll just hit file new scene for those following along. And then the first thing that we need in this scene is our AR camera. And this is gonna replace the default main camera. So we can actually delete that, boink. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna go up to game object, Vuforia, AR camera. And this is gonna add a new camera to our scene. Now this has the expected Unity camera component, but it also has this Vuforia behavior. And this is actually another place where you can get to the configuration. There's the button there that will take you directly to that asset as well. So we are going to use this to project our view of our camera into the world, right? So now if we take a look, We can see here are image targets, right? They're not activating because we're not configured yet, but we can see the, uh, the pieces of paper. We can see my hands, hi. And interestingly, if you're curious about how this looks in the scene view, right? It's just a big quad or plane with the texture of the camera projected onto it, right? So we just have this quad at the end of the view frustum, and then we're gonna put stuff inside the view frustum between the camera and this camera texture, right? So that is what that looks like. And so what we're gonna do is we've got our, our camera in, we've got our main camera, and the next step is gonna be to add some content. Shadowjack asks, will Vuforia work with a WebGL game? That's a really good question. Typically, Vuforia is targeted towards mobile and mobile and WebGL do not play nicely. They're not officially supported by Unity. So yeah, as Vinny says, uh, currently before it does not support WebGL. Yeah, I think that you're looking for platforms that have a camera, right? Basically mobile devices. And so WebGL doesn't play nice with mobile. I don't know if that's gonna be a great fit. King Creeper asks, is it possible to hook up an Android phone to use as a webcam? My guess is no. I've never seen anybody use an Android phone as a webcam just generally. So if it's not a webcam already, then probably not. Um, but keep in mind, right, the webcam, don't get too stuck on the webcam. The webcam here is really just for development. Normally we're gonna deploy to a mobile device that has a built-in camera. 